Wiped thin film distillation, sometimes called molecular distillation, is the separation process where fluids with different boiling point temperatures can be separated with great efficiency and high purity. In the cannabis world, thin film distillation is commonly used to purify cannabinoids after the oils have been extracted from the plant material. Extracted cannabis oil is very dark brown in color, sticky, and very thick at room temperature. It is sometimes referred to as crude oil, or full spectrum oil, and is the feed material for our distillation process. Because crude oil is very viscous at room temperature, it is first warmed to a liquid state in the feed tank. This oil is then pumped up through the feed tube into the main evaporation chamber. The three main elements of the chamber are the evaporator surface, the wiper, and the condenser. The process takes place in a vacuum which is monitored by the vacuum gauge. The vacuum is created by using two pumps, a mechanical roughing pump and a diffusion pump. Reducing the pressure reduces the boiling temperatures of the liquid which, in conjunction with the wiped film, creates greater efficiencies and purity. Following distillation, the oil is divided into two fractions known as the residue and the distillate phases. The distillate phase contains valuable cannabinoids rich in THC or CBD, while the residue phase contains impurities and other undesirable high molecular weight byproducts. The wiper rotates at several hundred RPMs by the motor on the top of the unit and creates a thin film on the surface of the evaporator, similar to the wiper blades on an automobile. The evaporation of the crude oil makes the distillation process more effective and facilitates the transformation of liquid oil into a gas phase. In this view, we see the crude oil mixture entering the sidewall of the evaporator. In this illustration, the mixtures are composed of distillate and residue, shown hypothetically as the letter D and R. Under very controlled temperature conditions, the desirable distillate portion is heated to its boiling point, which in turn vaporizes to form a gas vapor. The vapor phase molecules then returns to a liquid phase on the condenser, which is at a lower temperature. Finally. The distillate drips down the coils of the condenser and is pumped into the receiving vessel. The residue flows down the sidewall of the evaporator and is collected into another container. The distance between the evaporator surface and the condenser is sometimes referred to as a short path, which helps ensure product quality since the distillate is only in a vapor phase for a short period of time which reduces the chance of breakdown or oxidation. In summary, high purity cannabinoids are distilled from raw cannabis oil extract by selectively evaporating and recovering distillate phase using wiped thin film distillation. The distillate fraction is often a brightly colored yellow solution that will also become solid at room temperature. Cannabis distillates are odor free, high in purity, and ideal for edibles and other medicinal products.